Dividing fractions made easy, KFC method. Other mathematical terms we use are quotient, divide obviously, goes into and how many times. And here's another fact we need to know, the numerator and denominator, and if you get confused, remember D for down, that's where the denominator goes. To help us remember divide, we're going to KFC. Let's think about dividing up the chicken, KFC. So step one, K, keep it, keep the first fraction the same. Step two, F, flip it, flip the second fraction. Step three, C, change it, change the divide sign to a times. Step four, same as multiplication, multiply top by the top and the bottom by the bottom and simplify if necessary. Let's have a go at one then. So we've got two fifths divided by eight fifths. So K, F, C. So let's flip that, giving us five eighths. Change that, giving us a multiplication sign. So top by top, bottom by bottom. Two times five, that's 10. And five times eight, that's 40. Now we can see here that's easily simplified. They're both divisible by 10. Tens into 10 go one, tens into 40 go four. The answer, one quarter. So let's have a look. One half divided by two over six. K, F, C. Let's flip, six over two. Let's change, that's to a times and begin. Top by top, bottom by bottom. 1 times 6 is 6, 2 times 2 is 4. Now, that's an improper fraction, and what do we do? We call the doctor. D for divide, R for remain. So, 6 divided by 4 goes in one time with 2 remainder. So we carry across the 4, giving us 1 and 2 quarters. But hopefully you can see we can simplify that 2 quarters down, and that gives us 1 and a half. So you might get a whole number, so don't panic. What we need to do is rewrite this fraction as eight whole ones, so eight over one. Now we can begin. So K, F, C. Okay, let's flip that fraction, giving us three over four, and change that sign to a multiply. Top by top, off we go. Eight times three is 24, and one times four is four. Now we can see that that's an improper fraction, so we need to call the doctor. So that's D for divide, R for remain. 24 divided by four goes in six whole times with no remainders, so your answer is six. So here we have two thirds divided by eight ninths. So K, F, C. Let's flip, giving us nine eighths. Let's change that divide to multiply. So what we can see here is we can cancel across. If you can do this, you can reduce. So twos into two go one and twos into eight go four. Then the other side, threes into three go one and threes into nine go three times. So it gives us two whole new fractions. Let's multiply these. One times three is three and one times four is four. So that takes us to three quarters and we don't need to simplify. So this is our answer.